You are watching part one of the video series on the new features of Java 11. Java 11, released in September 2018, introduced several new features, enhancements, and changes. Let's explore these in detail with examples. Please bookmark this video for future reference. Pause wherever necessary to take a closer look. Local Variable Syntax for Lambda Parameters Java 11 allows using the var keyword in Lambda expressions to declare the type of Lambda parameters implicitly, making the code more concise. Check out the example here. String Methods Java 11 introduced several new methods in the string class to simplify common string operations. Isblank checks if a string is empty or contains only white spaces. Lines returns a stream of lines extracted from the string, separated by line terminators. Strip indent removes common leading white space from every line in a string. HTTP Client Java 11 introduced a new HTTP client API in the java.net.http package, which provides a modern, flexible, and asynchronous API for making HTTP requests. For more details on this new HTTP client API, please check out our video in the description. Nest-based access control. Java 11 introduced nest-based access control, which allows classes that are logically part of the same group to access each other's private members without the need for special access modifiers. Epsilon Garbage Collector Java 11 introduced the Epsilon Garbage Collector, which is a no-op garbage collector that does not perform any memory reclamation. It is useful for performance testing and for scenarios where memory management is not a concern. Epsilon Garbage Collector is explained in detail in another video. Video link is in the description. Launch Single File Source Code Programs Java 11 introduced the ability to run single-file Java source code programs directly without explicitly compiling them first. This feature is enabled by the source flag. These features and enhancements in Java 11 aim to improve developer productivity, simplify common tasks, and enhance the performance and security of Java applications. Hope this was helpful for you to get started with Java 11. Let's dive deeper and learn more about it by creating projects in the upcoming lessons. Please check out our playlist for more videos. And also like and subscribe our channel for more such informative content. Good luck!